you have 10 seconds to figure out what I what I'm making tonight for in uh, 10 9 8 7 6 oh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> oh darn it. no um, let's do it again Ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and zero. Okay, you had enough time to be <laughs> plenty of time to be able to figure out what I what I'm making. So I'm going to show you something that. And by the way, go to the last video. Go to the last video and see uh, what I said. And it's basically saying there's a grill right in front of me, the kitchen grill. Tell me what you think I'm going to make. It's a griddle. And you had the chance to guess what I'm going to make. It's not a quesadilla. But it is grilled cheese with a few other things. I'm not going to tell you until then. But I will definitely tell you what you can do to be able to make it. It actually is a better way of being able to make it. Come on, I grilled cheese. It's fun, it's easy, and you have to have a parent if you're a kid, so. Come on, Ed! So I'm letting, I'm letting Eddie in, because he just ate. Yes. Okay. So, come on, Eddie, move. Come on. So, I'm gonna... I'm gonna turn it on to 400, or I could just do about 325 on this one. 325 on this one, and I will definitely get that done. Um, so, I'm gonna prepare everything for what it needs to be. I will tell you the first thing that I'm going to do. So, the first thing, all the things is we're going to have Colby Jack, Colby Jack, you can get as much as you need to be able to make this, but I usually just get us like a, something like that. I'm going to cut the medium cheddar, and don't worry, you know, it is medium cheddar. I love cheddar, I love cheddar, I love nice cheeses. I do love stinker chairs, so I do love blue cheese, I do love Stilton and stuff like that. I really love a musky blue cheese, but that doesn't go well with grilled cheese, don't you think? So, while that is working, I am going to get something right here. I'm going to get the ham, Black Forest ham. Put it right onto the little block. Uh, I'm going to keep the shredded mozzarella, but I'm going to make something as well. I'm going to pick you up. And this is, this is my favorite thing. So, if you don't have a cheese grater, never use these. Use the big kind. So, if you have something like, oh, let me get it. This, it actually works a lot better because you have more consistency of uh, different things. So, I'm going to grate some cheese. Have your parents, or if you, if you're, if you're, if you're, if you're able to do this, I'm gonna cut a small portion. So this is a good thing. If you have a block of cheese like this, you can easily just and I can break it in half. So it looks like this. Sorry. So, 
I'm gonna put this right. Oh my god, I can't even do this. Come on. There we go. So I'm gonna get a bunch of this. Clean up after you're done with this. To be able. And you can see why this is so hard to do. So that's a good amount. I'm gonna do the same with the Colby, Colby Jack. Swell. Mix this around, get a little bit of each. Oh, let me see this. Ooh. Get that out. Make sure your cheese is okay. So, this will pretty much get everything together. This will be the cheese that you put on your grilled cheese. And there we go. Why didn't I have these scissors on here? Why is there scissors on here? I don't know. I'm going crazy. Where are you going? Where are you going? Crazy, you wanna come? Oh, I've already been there. Oh, welcome back. Okay, so. So, you're going to want just to take small shreds of this, the Black Forest ham, and just mix it in with the cheese. Notice I'm not taking measurements. I know about the It's not perfect, but, and it's messy. So every single time <clears throat> you make something, always clean up, always clean up. So I'm making this for me and me alone. So I'm gonna have a nice little salad with it. I'm going to have a nice little salad with it as well. Um, and the little ingredient that I thought would be really nice. Do you know what that is? Mm. Basil. I love basil. Basil actually gives it a nice fresh taste actually. And I love it because Oh god, I love that smell. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. And I don't know where to put this actually because well, okay. 